Veterans Memorial Stadium is the site of a Sunbelt Conference matchup featuring the 2-9 Texas State Bobcats and the Troy Trojans looking for their ninth win on Senior Day. Marcus Jones, one of the deep men, he is a dangerous return man. Jones had a couple of kick returns in one game for touchdowns against Coastal Carolina. And this time he'll have to settle for a return up near Number midfield. Averaging more than 400 yards a game. He'll go for a little bubble screen. And a chance for a big play. Inside the 20 and inside the 10. Emmanuel Thompson with his 35th catch of the year, and he almost took it to the house. He's off to the races. 48 yards. Now it's McCormick on the outside. He's down the barrier, and he's in for the score. Of course, they love to see teams in third and long, and they have Texas State in a third and nine. Williams going to try and take off, but he's not going to get anywhere. Wrapped up and dropped Marcus Webb, the first man to get him. Their best football in the last four or five games. Williams with time to throw over the middle. His pass is intercepted. Sedarius Rooker got his second of the season. A team that returned almost 99% of their production from a year ago. There's Emmanuel Thompson trying to get outside at the 25. He'll move the sticks easily. And he's thrown down by A.J. Krawczyk, the safety with help. But not before a gain of 15 for a Troy Trojans first down. Staff, so many weapons. Troy scored on three plays in their opening drive, and now Silvers will dump one down. Looks like he has a chance for another score, and he will indeed have a touchdown. Sam Letton on the receiving end. Less than a minute. Another big play and an opportunity for Jordan Shun to get his first big carry of the contest, and he'll move the sticks. At 235, but he's got the quickness. Carries for 18. Pass on the boundary is complete to John Johnson, able to step out of a tackle and finally smothered by Stefan Johnson. But another Troy first down. 32 yards out. It's a knuckleball that gets through and bangs off the building. Neil Brown's a smart guy, and when you build a program, you're going to have a target on your back, and that's where Troy is right now. Silvers wants the deep ball. Once again, he's got his man. It's DeAndre Douglas, a chunk play to the 21. Since he's taken over the duties, including one just a couple of minutes ago. This one's not even close. Partially deflected at the line of scrimmage, so Troy unable to add to their lead. A break for Texas State. Certainly he's going to be in some NFL camp next year. Play fake, and he has a lot of time to throw. Deep ball for DeAndre Douglas. Douglas almost stepped out of a tackle, and finally Krosick threw him down. Big gain of 29 yards. Offense after a couple of drives that have stalled. Back going again. Silvers, he wants it all. Looking downfield for Eford into the end zone. He's got it for the touchdown. Tyler White in motion. Williams wants the deep ball, and this one might be picked, and it is intercepted again by Troy. It's like this Trojan offense is this afternoon. Emmanuel Thompson steps out of a tackle. Nifty cut back into Texas State territory. And Krosick again, the last line of defense from his safety position. Interior linemen, three of their top five. Quick pass to Johnson. Johnson's loose. Krosick again, the last man there to save a touchdown. The first half. Looking for another score. Thrown on the run. We found the tight end. We heard they don't use them often, but it's going to result in a touchdown for Quisenberry. Philosophy in recent years it used to be that star players would not play special teams, and in college, you'll see a lot of the stars playing special teams. A lot of running room. Jordan Shun with a cutback. He stays on his feet. There is touchdown number 47 in his career. 
The football's loose and the Trojans may have it. Robert Brown never cleanly came up with it. And the worst case scenario again as the ball ends up in the hands of the Troy Trojans, Hunter Reese. Hunter Reese was given a scholarship in the spring. He made the tackle for a loss. He also recovered the fumble, and it leads to a pass that's caught inside the three. 23-yard attempt here. And it's through the pipes and good. A 41-point half for the Trojans. Williams with a pump fake. He wants the deep ball. Down the boundary for King, able to make the catch inside the five. Elijah King able to circle back to that football and make a great play. The nation, opponents have scored just 59% of the time. Not all the starters are in there, however. And Williams is going to go not only into the red zone, but into the end zone with a touchdown. It's exactly the way they hoped this second half would start. James Sherman, rather than Kilborn, attempted the extra point, and he missed it. Barker hangs in there, looks for the deep ball, well thrown into the hands of Willis, makes the catch at the seven. Six with three touchdowns and a couple of field goals. Barker will keep, Barker with a nose for the end zone, goes head over heels and lands in the end zone for the touchdown. My goodness, what a play. Points, you see it right here. We'll take a look here. Not only am I impressed with the effort, but the concentration to hold on to that football. Yeah, the Iron Bowl tomorrow. A lot of good football in this state. The Troy Trojans trying to get their 10th win. They're trying to get another touchdown. Barker had the rushing touchdown, and now he's going to get the receiving one. What a pitch and catch, and on the other end of that, into the end zone, was Hallman. Okay. Well, now you're getting to see the third-string quarterback in Cade Young, a freshman out of Tuscaloosa, and it ends up resulting in a B.J. Smith touchdown as he walks in. It may be is going to be in for quite a month of preparation. Anthony Smith gets loose. Biggest play of the day for Texas State that didn't involve a bobble and a dribble, but Anthony Smith in Detroit territory. They had a lot of games going on. Call them their Trojan games just to create some competition and some fun late in the year. Not much fun here for Damian Williams as he's wrapped up and he's going to be thrown down. Sacked by Walker Pritchett, the freshman linebacker. Long is 38. This is a 30 yard try for the left footed kicker. And this one is good. Again, it'll be interesting to see. What Coach Brown does next week and in the bowl game and how far this program can rise. Yeah, it's going to be fun to watch this team and see what they do in the bowl for sure. The Troy Trojans 9-2 on the season with that win against LSU. 6-1 in conference play as they handle Texas State without any problems today. 62-9. They led 41-0 at the half.